fellow Star Wars fans, my name is Starapter and welcome back to the channel. It's time to review another Inside Edition Star Wars book and this is The Secrets of the Clone Troopers written by Mark Sumerak, art by Alberto Busiccio. And this is just like the other books in this series, like we got in one about bounty hunters, about Wookiees, about Sith, about Jedi. This is for the Clone Wars fans. Simply put, if you are a Clone Wars fan, I highly recommend this book. Now getting into it, as you would expect. So everything about the backstory of why the clones were created, the template of Jango Fett himself, getting into the lore about him with these Mandalorian Civil Wars and how he got his best car armor. Like, so there's actually secrets in here of lore that we haven't actually gotten before. There's great images of Keller and Beck and Cal Kestis during uh, Order 66. There's everything about the armor of the clone troopers, about the vehicles, such as the Acclimator class uh, transports, the uh, other ones, the Venator class, Star Wars, everything from Bark Speeders, everything about the various people of importance, such as Rex is the first big important one. He's the narrator of this entire book, talking to us as the audience about how he survived, about what was going on. And speaking about Rex, I like how Mark Sumrak, using Rex's voice, talks about uh, why it is so important to respect soldiers that have done their duty. And that kind of reflects our real life situation about a lot of these veterans don't really get the respect they deserve. So it's kind of this cool uh, little meta take on things of our real life, which I really appreciated there. But oh my goodness, this artwork by Alberto uh, Busiccio is absolutely iconic. This There's so many amazing visuals of realistic renditions of battles of Teth, of battles of Umbara, of the battle of Geonosis for, you know, all these different things. We get to see the different Jedi generals and their legions of, of clone troopers. We get to see the Bad Batch. We get to see... Uh, Cody, we get to see just uh, dossiers on all the different separatist droids and how they function. Literally, no stone is left unturned except when it comes to the Saber class tank. That's the one gripe I have with this book. I don't know why Star Wars canon just can't live up to that awesome tank that we've seen in the Clone Wars video game. It's a part of Star Wars Legion, it's a part of Star Wars Battlefront 2, so it's as canon as canon gets. Just a little bit of a blurb on that would have been good. I know that's my own little desire that I'm just still craving for from Star Wars canon from 2015 onward to this day. So um, we even get to see Rex in his Endor gear and a little bit reference again to that point of that. So yeah, this is just an easy recommendation for any Clone Wars fan. It chronicles all these battles. It chronicles the beginning of the Clone Wars up into the end and what happens with the clones afterwards as we've seen in the Bad Batch. So it's kind of a catch-all book for everything clones for everything prequels you're going to want to pick this one up let me know in the comment section down below for more on star wars for more on reviews it's a very busy review season for me just coming back from new york comic con i have my review um or my recap rather for the latest star wars uh short story and insider i have a upcoming review for star wars glass abyss the mace windu novel so Make sure you are subscribed to the channel so you'll know when that video goes live. And also for my New York Comic Con adventures, I have a whole vlog dedicated to that as well. So that's going to do it for me, Star Wars. Thank you so much for watching, and may the Force be with you always. Thanks for checking out the video. Please hit that thumbs up symbol. It helps me know that I'm making content that you guys enjoy. And if you enjoyed this video, I also include two videos down below you guys should check out. And please consider subscribing to this channel. It helps support me and it notifies you guys of when I get new videos up on the channel. You can also contact me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at Star Raptor.